Hello Internet, um, in this uh, lecture I'm going to show you how to roll out a page in AEM. Now rolling out a page in AEM is a part of a larger concept about um, authoring in a multi-site manager. So let's log in to our AEM uh, instance here, let's look at site, uh, let's go to WeRetail, let's pick, um, first let's notice one thing language masters that basically means uh, in AEM uh, you get to work on content um, once and you want to write it everywhere so if you have a language like different versions of English you probably want to have a language master for English where you work on all English pages and then roll them out to the different locales you know the different English uh, speaking uh, and you can have a regional uh, master for uh, the regional language, for example, uh, um, you can have the English for the Americas and also you can have a regional uh, master for the English uh, in the European Union and the same for Africa and, you know, for other locations. And it, basically, it just makes your life so much easier. You, you write content once and you roll it out to, um, to, 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 to the descendants of that language. Uh, in, in different locations or locales. So you create the page there, assuming we're doing an English page. Uh, we can do one and um, man. So you create one there. It's a page. And let's say we pick up that as a template. We call our rollout. We call it rollout test. Uh, rollout doesn't matter. Um, once that page loads, we can be able to edit it. And we're going to add some dummy content in it. And then um, so you can do the rollout process. So let's say um, you can choose your components there, or you can choose them from the side again. We prefer to use the side here because I want to do the drag and drop. And I don't want to add the image component. I want to drag the image in a, into the uh, paragraph system there. And then I can come there and look for text component and just to drag it there. And once I have it in there, I can call that and I say covered. Nice. And I can copy. I can make that text um, an H2 and I can copy that and AEM gives you this option where you're able to copy, paste, delete, cut, edit, you know, configure, you know, and you can look at the inheritance there, you can cut a rollout, you can roll out a component by itself from that. And I'll show you that. Um, let's uh, copy that and let's paste it there. And let's say covered in lava. I think that's how you spell it. <clears throat> so, assuming our page looks good, viewers published, and that's the WCM Web Content Manager mode is equals to disabled, and you're able to see that. Um, we can come here and we can roll out this page from the language master we can roll it out um, so let's go back again we should be able to give you the options of the languages that you're trying to roll it out to so roll out page and you can see that English Canada US English we can decide to just send it to Canada only um you know and that rolls out successfully once it gives you that rolled out successfully you can go back now before before we go to look for that page in the english uh, canadian site let's just say you can roll out the component level and that's where you do it you know and you can see it gives you the same options it, 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 it gives you a blanket rollout which means you roll out to all the pages that are connected to this or you can roll out two and still gives you so if you made a change and the change did not affect the whole page you don't want to roll out the whole page 
especially on landing pages so you want to roll out only a component and that's a good option there to choose yeah so let's go back to the site here and look for Canada site and English and we added a page and that's our page that we just rolled if you highlight and check that page check mark you can see that we did it all out a minute ago by the administrator so that's how you do a rollout within Adobe Experience Manager and that's how you roll out a page and that practice is critical when it comes to managing a multilingual site in a year thank you if you like uh, our content you know subscribe or just uh, give us some love you know leave us a comment if you think we should have explained the concept differently um, we appreciate your support thanks